It's one of the biggest parties of the year, and it's all for a good cause. The charity preview at the North American International Auto Show raises millions of dollars for children's charities. Our Rod Maloney was in the middle of all the festivities tonight. The obvious thing you notice when you come to this year's charity preview is the size of the crowd. Much like last year, they sold 13,000 tickets, raised $5 million. And everybody here seems to be having the best time you can imagine. And who wouldn't when there's live jazz at the ZF stand? Now, Como Center's floor is notoriously hard on the feet, which is why the first stop for a lot of women wearing shoes that look this painful is the cars.com table where they hand out the slippers. To dance, to dance later. Because they're very valuable towards the end of the night, you really need that. Bob Eufer, yes, of the famed U of M Eufer family, knows to wear comfortable footwear. They are exclusive tennis. I only use them for the auto show. The wine this year, all California Cabernet and Chardonnay. Cheers. But the beer, Detroit Dwarf, in honor of the Nain Rouge. Notable this year was the headgear from cowboy hats to headbands to this handmade masterpiece called a fascinator with uh, peacock feathers to match the green portion in my dress and uh, it, my boyfriend helped to construct it. Three people are identified with this hat, Lester Young, Frank Lloyd Wright and then George Anandi. Meet George Anandi. This year the gowns didn't inhibit motorcycle shopping or picture posing on the floor. We're seeing more kilts from differing clans as well. Canadian Scottish clan Mackay. And as the tradition, they have a concert here. This year it's the Beach Boys that we're not allowed to show you, but a lot of other people who don't go to the concert end up at private parties. But now it's your turn, your opportunity to see the cars and trucks bright and early tomorrow morning. At Cobo Center, Rod Maloney, Local 4. And that'll happen tomorrow. Auto show officially opens to the public at 9 a.m. Tickets are $13 for adults and $7 for seniors and children.